Hey everybody, it is Allie Palmgren, the Assistant Director at the Weston Public Library, here to give you a little rundown on how to use RV Digital, which is a really great way to see all the wonderful magazines, popular magazines, that you love to look at at the library right from the comfort of home. So it is super, super, super. So the way to do that, and we're going to start out on the library homepage, just because that's probably how you're going to get to it is either to go to the library homepage and you can go to ebooks and much more or use the quick link on the left hand side of the page for RB Digital magazines uh, or you can download the app on the RB Digital app on your phone or tablet. Um, there are versions for iPhones, uh, for Android phones and tablets uh, as well as for your Kindle Fire. So those are uh, available through the various app stores. And it is a really good experience um, watching it, especially or seeing it on a tablet in particular because it's really bright and vibrant. All right, so we're going to go to eBooks and much more. And this will get you into some of these services. If you need um, to reset your PIN for your library card because you don't remember it, you will need your PIN for this service. You'll want to do that by resetting it online by following this link here. If you don't have a library card yet, you can get an e-card um, through the link right below the password or PIN reset. So what you can do is you can scroll down until we get to digital library here and RB Digital is the one that we're going for. So we're going to get started by logging in. Okay, so if you had never registered before, you would click register and put in um, your email address and your library card number. That will be your username generally, unless you've changed it. Um, and then your password is your PIN. I'm gonna click sign in because I have signed in before. All right. All right, so I'm going to sign in, and there we are. Okay, so it says, welcome, Weston. I guess that's us. All right, so if I want to see a particular magazine, there are 50 magazines to, to choose from here, and they are the most popular ones. So I'm going to hit explore, and we'll see a whole bunch of different ones. Um, the most popular one, just a little tidbit of information here, for the town of Weston in general is the New Yorker. It's very popular. Um, as you can see, if you're going to go buy it on the newsstand, it's $8.99 every time that you'd like to read this. That's super expensive, especially for um, a weekly magazine. So um, we're so happy we can offer this to people uh, for free through using their library card. So let's actually, let's choose The New Yorker. Why not? And there are a lot of other great titles here. Vanity Fair, uh, National Geographic Vogue. Oh, Bon Appetit, that's one of my favorites. Um, lots of great ones, popular ones for cooking, for, oh, Bicycling's another favorite of mine. That one's a really good one. Um, but yeah, lots of great stuff here. A uh, little bit for everybody, National Geographic Kids. Highlights, who doesn't love highlights? I mean, you don't get the stickers in the digital magazine, but you get everything else. So that's pretty cool. Um, we're gonna go up to um, the most popular one because why not? We're gonna go to the New Yorker and click on that there. All right, so if I wanna check this out, I will click check out. Um, there are back issues as well. So if you are interested in that, you could just click all issues and you could see um, earlier issues that are available. And there are lots of good ones here. Um, so it's not just the most current. It's also things um, from the past if you've missed those as well, which is really awesome. Now there's no due date. Um, you can keep this on your device uh, for as long as you want to be reading it, which is wonderful as well. So I'm clicking check out. It says checking. This should just be a second. All right, wonderful. You have checked out the magazine, The New Yorker. We can keep browsing or read now. You can also choose to automatically check out the next issue. So that's a great idea if it's something that you're going to continually want to read. So I'm clicking read now and this will have it read in my browser. 
Now you can also, like I said, do this on um, a tablet or a phone. And the nice thing about the phone or the tablet is it is um, full screen and it really looks beautiful. Not that it doesn't look beautiful here, but it is exactly like the magazine in print that you would see, including the ads, including all the, um, you know, the contents, all that great stuff. So the nice thing we have here is that it does display just the way it would um, if you were looking at it on a um, on a physical page here. Now there are some options. So there's a table of contents that's clickable. You can put in a bookmark. You can also view the text view. So if this is a little bit difficult for you to read, if you hit text view, it's just going to take out um, some of the visual content um, with the ads and things, and it will just give you plain text. You can also print it, which is wonderful, um, especially for some of these great recipes that you find um, in some of the magazines like um, Bon Appetit. That, that's even better. So you can kind of flip through, which is awesome. It even has the comics, all your favorite things that you would see there. Uh, the thing that I like to do sometimes is to zoom in to read. So there's a little plus button there. And it'll take a second, but it'll zoom in so you can, um, it makes every magazine a large print magazine. So you don't have to worry about having, um, having the font be too small. Now it still is a little bit little here, but if you kind of keep going, beautiful, gets much easier. So that's pretty much that. Um, that opened it up in another tab. So when I'm through with it, I can just close this tab. Um, and I can go back to browsing and I can find something else that I might be interested in. Um, that's one that I saw before down here. I think I saw bicycling. There we go. Love that. So great. This looks like a good one. Springtime, we want to get outside. I'll check out that magazine. And we have unlimited checkouts. So as many magazines as you want to check out per month, you check them out. And it doesn't uh, matter that you've checked them out. Anybody else can check them out at the same time, which I think is, is pretty awesome. So if you do have any questions about this, please feel free. Ooh, there we go. That looks great. Um, ooh. All right, now I'm, I'm getting into this and now all I want to do is ride bikes and read magazines. But if you do have questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to us. Go back to the... Uh, Weston Public Library website, which is westonlibrary.org. When we are open, you can just hit contact us and it'll give us give you the phone numbers where you would be able to contact us regularly or by email. Um, when we are closed, like we are at this um, particular point, um, you can look for information on how to leave a message and we'll get right back to you. Um, right now we have some on the homepage, some numbers you can dial or an email you can uh, send a message to and we'll be able to help you out in figuring out how to, to get all set up with RB Digital. So thanks so much and happy reading.